The world seems to be collapsing around us, but I believe we have a chance now to build a new civilization of the future that is more creative, ethical, free, rich, preserving of nature than anything in history. Bitcoin was the first global decentralized ledger, a money system immune to manipulation. Ethereum was the first global decentralized computer, a computing platform that runs programs immune to manipulation. So upon this platform, we can build new systems of money, but we can also build financial programs around that money and therefore build a new parallel financial system. And Ethereum programs are Turing complete, which means they're general. So we can also build systems for doing science, journalism, education, media, funding of the arts. We can build a new parallel society. And as the capstone of the societal operating system, we can build reimagined systems of government, new kinds of democracy. So this Ethereum world computer can serve as the foundation for a civilization that we build out of code. I often think of the set of systems and institutions that our society runs on as our civilizational ship. We're out at sea in this ship, and our ship is old, it's dysfunctional, it's corrupt, it's broken, and by God, it's taking on water. This ship is sinking and it cannot be saved. Instead, we need to build a new civilizational ship that's fit for the 21st century, that harnesses modern technology instead of fighting against it, and we need to migrate over to that thing as quickly as possible because the water is rising. And I think we can all feel this. We can feel some kind of impending doom. We can sense the rising water. Some people who feel this want to go back. No more technology, no more industry, decelerate, degrowth. There's danger ahead. And there is danger ahead, but we can't go back. We have to go forward and create the future we want. It can be a good future if we make it so. And I don't just think this civilizational ship can be built. I know it. I can see it. The mission of my life is to draw and explain this vision as best I can. That's the whole purpose of my videos. The true spirit of the West is not Christian, it's Promethean. For the Greeks, it was Prometheus who created mankind, giving us a soul in the form of a butterfly, symbolizing transformation, because our nature is to evolve and change. We don't have a fixed nature. Man is something that should be overcome, as Nietzsche wrote in Thus Spoke Zarathustra. Prometheus, of course, also stole the fire of science, technology, and the arts from Zeus and gave this as a gift to mankind because science, technology, and the arts drive evolution. Prometheus wanted us to break out from under the tyrannical, patriarchal Zeus to no longer be led like herd animals, but to become masters of our own destiny, to chart our own course. So let's do that. Let's build a civilizational ship of the future and sail that thing to new horizons. This is our destiny. And what have we got to lose?